Two teenagers were arrested for making threats against Lawrence County High School. Two teens were arrested and charged on Thursday night. This is the latest in more than 20 arrests made for making threats against schools in North Alabama since September 9th. Police are telling parents that every threat is being taken seriously. Huntsville area Congressman Dale Strong has introduced a new bill to expand nuclear power in the U.S. and it could have an impact in North Alabama. News 19's chief investigative reporter Brian Lawson joins us now. And Brian, Congressman Strong mentioned the Belfont site in Jackson County as a possible location for the proposed project. That's right. TVA has invested about $5 billion in the plant over the years. Construction started on the Belfont site in the 70s with two proposed nuclear reactors, but cost issues led them to abandon the project in the 80s. TVA looked at finishing the site at various points and in 2016 sold the property to a Tennessee-based group for $111 million, but the sale was never completed and TVA won a related lawsuit. A TVA spokesman told me today the utility's goal is to return the Hollywood, Alabama site to productive use, but no decisions about the property have been made. Now, Congressman Strong's bill calls for construction of two small modular reactors on current or former nuclear plants by 2034. Strong said Belfont is one of the sites that qualify under his bill. The proposal would focus on a new design unrelated to what's currently on site. Now, Congressman Strong outlined his thinking today, saying in part, Winter Storm Elliott was a wake-up call for us all. To avoid shortages in the future, we must be constantly investing in modern energy sources to power our economy for the next generation. North Alabama Congressman Robert Adderhold also spoke on the new modular bill, saying residents of Alabama's 4th Congressional District should never be subjected to a lack of power or lack of economic opportunities due to electric providers not being able to produce adequate energy supplies. Now, TVA said it plans to invest $6.2 billion over the next 20 years in its nuclear plant operations. Tamika?